Amnesia. Hello, my friends, and welcome to a new little Let's Play series on my channel of Reveal the Deep. I've been looking at this game for a while. I don't know a lot about it. There's no music on the menu, so <laughs> I'm really curious what this going to, is going to be like, but I thought I would go ahead and try it out, see how it goes. Thought it might be kind of a fun one to play on my channel. Uh, this is the the main menu, so it looks pretty simple. I think that says Lazy Men Day Games? I think? I'm not really sure. It looks like we're supposed to just click Chapter 1, and I guess that's just how we start it. So I don't know anything about the controls or anything, but we're just gonna go ahead and wing it and see how it goes. Let's see if this works. Oh, here we go. Press the left and right arrows to run in that direction. Okay. Look at us. Oh, oh, it makes it dark. Press the down key to crouch. Ooh, the sun's kind of spooky. Press it to stand, then to jump. Okay, so you go down, up, down. Okay, so you don't have to hold it. Oh, oh dear. From what I've heard, this is a little bit of a creepy game. Press P for pause or escape. Okay. Okay. The sounds are kind of spoopy. Press space to turn your life. Oh. Oh, interesting. Maybe we go over here? That's pretty interesting. Okay, let's go over here. Doesn't look like there's anything over here. Oh, let's walk over this way. Oh gosh, these sounds. These sounds are pretty spoopy. Okay, so let's turn this off. Oh, now we can walk through here. What do you know? Okay. I hope this isn't gonna- this isn't- I- I don't want to be scared. I hope this isn't gonna pop out and scare me or something. There's a squid! Interact by standing it and hitting right shift. Oh! Oh, it's a ladder. Okay. Oh, it's locked. Okay, so we need to go find a key or something. Let's go up here. What's up here? Okay, can we make this jump? Ugh, not quite. But maybe if we... No, nothing there. Maybe if we turn off our light up there, we'll see a different pathway. Whoops. Okay, so pretty simple controls. Nope. It just gets real dark. Oh, I see. I can jump. I can delay my jump. So if I drop down and then I jump, it might be okay. Ah, oh, didn't quite make it. Let's try one more time. If we don't make it, we'll go ahead and just drop down. But I really would like to go in that door, and I imagine we're probably gonna have to... Ugh, okay. Can't quite make that. Let's go this other way. Maybe it'll circle around or something. Okay, there's a ladder. Okay, so we can climb up these ladders, too. Can I keep going down? Huh. How do I... I'd like to keep going down, but I guess that block is in the way. Whoops. So what can we do here? Still locked. So we must have to go up here. This has to be it. Oh, oh, silly me. Silly me. 
<laughs> I should have known that. Oh, look, there's a key. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, no. I want to go up. Okay, there we go. How do I get to that key? Maybe up here? Maybe this way? I bet if we turn off our light, it's gonna change here. Okay, so those lights are the trick. Okay, keep pushing. Can I not push? That's weird, I can't push it if I don't have my light on. Alright, let's go this way. See what's up here. Okay, we got the key. Thank you. I think there was more over here to the left. Let's go over here. Check this out. Oh. What's here? Oh, it's just like, hey, do you want to use the key on this? No? Okay. Huh. Maybe we're supposed to go back to that door first. Let's go do that. Let's go check out that door. Oh, it's gonna change. Let's check out this typewriter. Dearest Alice, ooh, 1901. With significant difficulty, I have gained passage aboard a vessel heading to England. SS Eurydice will depart Singapore on the morrow. It has been charted by a man introduced as Professor Crook to move cargo collected in his recent expedition. He was set to refuse me until he learned I was once an explorer. I hate this boat. It's size is like nothing imaginable. It feels empty and hollow inside. There cannot be more than a hundred people on board. I met Crook's journalist, Tom, little more than a boy. He won't leave me in peace, constantly asking about my travels. I think I'm beginning to like the brat. Your faithful husband, Isaac. Okay. Let's turn on our light again. Let's go back. Down here. Let's go back to the door. Did we try... Ah... Oh, oh dear, oh dear. I didn't mean to do that. Oh! <gasps> okay, I'm officially not okay with this game. <laughs> Climb up this. <laughs> what was that? Okay, that's just for that, that section. Now how are we gonna get back up there? I guess maybe we do have to go these other ways. Is that gonna thump again? <laughs> What's this? What is this thing? Interact with this. It's marked anchovies. Splendid. My favorite. What about this guy? Oh, it's just the same. Okay. Is there anything here? Oh. Oh, plot twist. Oh gosh. I need to use that. Eh. Okay, I see, I see. I see how this business works. Let's go up here. I feel like maybe I'm missing things. Okay, now we can push this out of the way. And go unlock that door. Okay. Just 
just got bigger. Can I not? There we go. Ooh, spoopy. Beatrice's diary. I saw something moving on one of the lower decks. It looked like black mud. The air around it felt bitter and primal. It moved on its own, feeling its way across the walls and floor. I felt terribly ill and fled to the upper decks. When I returned with the others to the corridor, it was gone. It was as if it was written out of the ship's blueprints. Ooh. Spoopy, spoopy! Oh, I see. So, like, taking off our light kind of, like, sends us back in time in a way. Oh, I fell a lot further than I intended to. I feel like I'm missing things. I can't, like, crouch jump. Let's go up here. Back in time. I shall miss Singapore, though I look forward to telling Timothy and Emma of my wonderful travels. Amidst the business of loading that enormous crate onto the boat, Professor Crook still found time to invite me to dine with himself and some of the crew. At dinner I met a rather frightening man named Isaac. His presence seemed to fill the room. I was able to enjoy the meal thoroughly thanks to Tom telling me all about the island which they discovered. Apparently, it is home to a long-dead civilization that ex the explorers are bringing back artifacts to England. Okay, so we're kind of figuring out the story here. What happened? We need to drop down just a little bit. Okay, perfect. Let's climb up here. Yeah. Score. Ooh. Nice drawings, Tom. We've been on the island a little more than an hour and I've seen a dozen species of birds I am certain have never been recorded. I'm afraid my sketches show these beautiful creatures little justice. Those are beautiful. Okay. Huh. Oh, I need that. <laughs> I need that to get out of here. Turn on my little light. Let's go up first. Oop. Oh, there's... is this that black goop? This is making me nervous. <gasps> what is this? Ooh. Spoopy, spoopy. It's a sink filled with black gunk. Okay. Let's go up here. Oh, we gotta jump across. Go over this way. Oh, that's just a little nook. Okay. So there's some of the black goop. <gasps> oh my gosh, that scared me! Didn't think a little pixel game. Okay, let's do this again. I'm not gonna jump. Oh, actually, I, did. I still jumped a little bit. Okay, don't go that way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Who knew an 8-bit game could uh, make me jump? 
quite like that. <laughs> okay, let's go this way. Push this guy down. Uh. Uh. Okay. Nothing. Okay, we're back down here. So that was our way to get across there, but let's- let's go- I think we missed some stuff here. Ugh. My heart is still racing from that little spoopy black goop. Is there any, uh, light or anything? Nope. How do I make that jump? Ugh. I don't know that I can. Yeah, it's just a little too high. This is dead in there. Let's drop down here and see what happens. Okay, it looks like it's back to this. Oh, not okay. I'm a lot slower. Am I trying to get this crab? Come here, little buddy. Are you trying to show me something? Let's see what's over here. Is he gonna keep following me? No. Huh. I'm not sure what to do here. Can I do this? Now I'm like underneath. I'm quite sure I'm supposed to do something with this crab, but I'm not sure what. Hey little crab, can you uh you be my friend? Huh. Yeah, not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Maybe we should go back up, because I think there was a different path that we could have gone there. Maybe that would actually give us some answers. We go up this way, and then I think there was a ladder. Yeah, this one over here. Oh, oh, oh. Let's go up to that. I want to go up to that first. Nope, nothing here. Okay. Annie is scrolled on the left paw. Left paw? Let's see, is that what those are called? There's another little spot here. Oh, I can't get off though? Okay. Tom's expedition log. We discovered these strange cubes on the island. There we go. They are carved of stone, but they weigh far less than they should, and they are slightly warm to the touch. One of our crew said he was... He saw one flying a few feet above the ground. It's not something I would usually believe, and yet the cubes seem to give off a strange sort of energy. Okay. So we've learned a little bit. Wait, can I? No, I can't just like float around. I got real excited there. I thought maybe I was going to be able to, you know, just jumpity jump. Yeah, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do next. So we need to figure out how to get that one thing. This crab, maybe. I don't want to go there. Cause you're freaking creepy! What if we walk there in the dark? 
Ooh. <laughs> okay. Well, that answered that question. <laughs> oh, I'm such a wimp. Okay. I feel like we're backtracking. But we've got to be missing something here. There was nothing really in this room either, right? Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, we saw the sink. We saw the sink. Alright. Gotta maybe find another one of those cubes or something. I think we've gone through here. Yeah. This is where we came down. Okay. So let's go over here. Let's go back down and see. I'm, there's gotta be something that we're supposed to do here. Because this whole room lights up. So we're missing something. Maybe it's up, up above. Maybe we're supposed to do something up there. Or something with this little crab, but I don't know how to get you to do anything. Like, this makes sense to me that we would maybe do something with these, like, shoots. Will he, like, walk over here? He's just gonna chill out there. He's cute, that's for sure. So what if we do it right here? This lights up this whole room down here. But it doesn't really... give us anything new. Huh. Bizarre. So maybe we missed something along the way further back. I think we'll go ahead and just have to continue this in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time as we try to figure out what we're supposed to do next with these guys. So, see you then!